Share the love. How do you share love? Better yet, how do you show love? Good questions. Do you have good answers? The other day, a wonderful couple handed me a big old bag, you know, big old satchel bags. It was filled with M&Ms and two big pieces of cake. And I had a handwritten, very artistic note on it, which just said, thank you, Pastor Carney. We love you. Showing love through cooking and eating, especially with M&Ms, my favorite method. But seriously, how has God wired you to show love? Now, some people prefer to use words. Others, by serving. Still others, giving of gifts. Many people, simply being together. Quite a few, by touching and holding hands. Cooking works best when then eaten by someone, hopefully around the same table as the chef sprinkled with lots of conversation, servings of laughter, and even perhaps a song or two. Well, how do you prefer to be loved? How often do you miss when someone's showing you they care? Not surprisingly, Jesus covers the love waterfront. He repeatedly spoke words of love to us. As the Father has loved me, so have I loved you. Now remain in my love. His entire life consisted of serving, loving people who believe themselves unworthy to be served or even loved. The centurion replied, Lord, I do not deserve to have you come under my roof, but just say the word and my servant will be healed. Jesus partied in homes and he ate with sinners demonstrating the power of presence. While Jesus was having dinner at Matthew's house, many tax collectors and sinners came and ate with him and his disciples. He broke all cultural norms, touching the sick and the unclean. For he had healed many so that those with diseases were pushing forward to touch him. Love, showing love, he gifted the world of himself, sacrificing his life for ours. For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only Son, that whosoever believes in him shall not perish but have everlasting life. Whichever way you prefer to be loved, Jesus did it. So that the world would know of God's infinite love, so that you would know of his infinite love that he has for you. So go ahead and share that love today. This has been Coffee with Carney.